Okay, if you look closely right here, you'll notice uh, right at this area, it's uh, honed all the way to the edge. And uh, when we come up, you see the light reflecting right at the edge, right there. There's still that bevel. I want to continually, uh, continuously eliminate this area to get rid of that. As you can see right here in this area, I finally got to the edge and it's still in the convex edge. You can see the edge is still round. But once get to here, you see the light reflecting at the edge, a very small one. That brings that entry angle to about maybe roughly 30, 35. I want to try to bring the entry angle down to about maybe 25 degrees, 20, 25 degrees to give me a little more advantage. Still retain the convex for separation uh, without drag. And uh, that's the plan. The way you reprofile a blade, you put a towel right here to secure or right in any area, make sure that your hand is out of the way. Now, I explained before, basically I'm trying to bring down the convex. So when you get on the stone, most of the time, you're just in a rock and rock back and forth motion. Your hand can have a slight wrist movement if you need to, to retain that convex. Now, uh, most of the time, you don't really need to do this. If you're stone, you've been using it for a while, it'll have a curve or indention. You guys can see uh, there's a slight curve. Well, if it's hard to see, um, then sorry about that, but on there. So basically, you get your towel, hold it real thick, and then you get on the stone. Go back and forth. Because what you're trying to do is bring the convex down and then uh, re-angle it till the blade gets to the edge. So as you can see, this side is already done. You can see everything is perfectly smooth. When I bring my finger down, you can see the mark directly goes to the edge. But this side is not. This side has a little more convex than the other side. A little more roundness. So every single time after you uh, finish uh, going back and forth, you wipe it and you check it to see if that convex goes right all the way to the edge. A lot of times you'll see right at the edge right there, there's a reflection. That's a roundness right there. Now you know the cutting plane is, is round. I mean you can see it, you know, just by visually. But once you get to the edge, you can see it's still shiny right here on the edge. That means there's still an aggressive curve right at the edge so this is what we're trying to eliminate completely no curve put both sides in symmetry to about 20 degree entry angle
Sudah Oh. <sighs> 